Here is our yeah. little room. Come on. We're in a silver noodle making class. Okay, here we go. I'm naked right now. <laughs> are you excited, Sophie? Yes. Hello, we are in Matsumoto. We're just going into the castle area now. So yeah, welcome to this vlog. Like, what is he doing? <laughs> He's not got any like harness or anything. Go back to safety, sir. We had a celebration oh. to save 400 years Wow. And soon, in 2094, we're going to have 500. Wow. <laughs> so please come again. There's <laughs> <laughs> a little sake brewery we went on a wee self-guided tour of. Very weak, but we're gonna go sample some sack, you know, so that should be nice. Let's go. Yeah. We're about to have a lunch in this nice little bubble. Corona who? We don't know her. <gasps> Look at these fluffy boys outside. So this is the oldest elementary school in all of Japan. I believe it's from the 1800s. Just a long time ago, so we're gonna go in and check that out. All these class photos over here. This is from the Meiji area. Meiji area era. When was Meiji? 1897. 1897. <laughs> we are at Zenkoji Temple in Nagano City now. How are you feeling about this class? <laughs> We are about to make soba noodles. We're in a soba noodle making class. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Your back is so hunched. <laughs> my back is dying again. <laughs> I also had to like lower the apron below my crotch because all of the stuff is here and I'm too tall for it. <laughs> There's the girls working hard with their pictures. <laughs> There she goes, cutting away. When you look down because of the mask and the hair, it just does look like a big black hole. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so these are my freshly cut soba noodles. It'll get sent off to cook and I'll be able to eat my, my nudes. Itadakimasu! Soba's a very kind of bland food, like it usually is meant to be that way, so... It's nice! Oyaki, which is one of the famous foods in this area. It's like uh, basically a dumpling. This one's mixed vegetable. We also got potato one, sweet potato, pumpkin. How are your guys' ones? Really good. Here is our Ryokan room. Well, we are changed into our yukatas. Hello! We just had a long photo shoot. Dinner is being served to us at 7, I think. Um, so we're gonna go to the onsen that's part of the Ryokan now. But then we've booked the private onsen that they have as well for later in the evening. Uh, bye! There's no one here, so real fast gonna show you what it's like in the public onsen area for the men. Hi. I thought this mushroom thing was de decor, but no, this is an actual plant. We're just gonna pick the mushrooms off, pop them onto here for 10 minutes and eat them. <laughs> Sake that we bought today at the tasting, and we're gonna go up to the private onsen now. How exciting. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Are you excited, Sophie? Yes. Beautiful. I'm naked right now. I feel like I'm boiling alive. I can barely get my body in, let alone my legs. Guys, I look sunburned after that experience. 1800 yen we paid between three of us to rent that private onsen for 40 minutes. And like, as time went on, I think just the cold air after taking the cover off eventually made it colder. I think they should have opened it before we went up because honestly, we wasted so much time just trying to get in. And I'm ready to sleep now after that ordeal. Oh, and here's like our futons. They actually put these out while we were at dinner. So we came back and then suddenly, beds. See the snow monkeys. We're getting a lift 
from and do it at the hotel. It's still a 25 minute walk though. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Did you almost fall? <laughs> we just keep taking turns tripping on stuff, so like, just casually walking here on an icy ground with my camera in the air, because I'm a sensible boy. <laughs> Let's make some crunchy snow steps. Oh, it's kind of frozen. <laughs> We're at Togakushi. It's a whole area full of like shrines and other stuff. It's very pretty, but there's a lot of walking involved. So we're gonna be walking for a good half hour. So keep your fingers crossed for me. On our way back now, we're kind of over taking photos and stuff. We took a lot and it was a lot of walking. So I'm excited to put the camera away now, but it was really fun. I really enjoyed. This whole trip's been fab. I didn't think there would be that much to do in Nagano. I'm not really good at finding stuff to do, but Sophie and her are really good at it. And we've just done a bunch of day trips. We've been doing this for three days. I kind of wish I'd gone a little bit earlier in the year, but this is just when it worked out that I could go. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh, subscribe. Hobbling along, trying not to fall. 